buzz bombs are so versatile, right? You got just a couple components, makes it super simple. You can rig out of the package right there, straight on the main line, tie on your hook and you're fishing. But for me, I like to make my rigs a little bit more interchangeable as well as helping with any potential line twist. Because to be honest, with the amount of spinning that those buzz bombs do create, it's good, but you can run into some line twists. So my solution is super simple as well. You just add a little tiny bearing swivel like you said, see there. Okay, tie on, I got a foot tag, foot and a half tag a liter. Now we're gonna rig this right here to show you. So we got, as I told you, one of my favorite coho colors. It's glow in the dark, it's a green stripe. And this is what I'll do. So what's cool, if you can see this here, on the buzz bomb, there's instructions. You got a fatter end up front, skinnier tapered end in the bottom it does have an arrow saying hook pointing that way so what i do is you thread it up okay there is the top part of that boom now it comes with these really cool little rubber stops it's a bumper for your knot you will thread that on. They also make separately, if you like to fish single hooks, you can run that with a little spacer. Now, package comes with a treble hook. Washington State cannot use treble hooks in the salt water, so this will get changed to a siwash hook. But for the purposes of showing you, and tie our ward knot, triple loop, cinch it down. And that is your buzz bomb rig. For simplicity of the basic rig that'll catch a ton of fish, there it is right there. The reason why, on top of saving line twist by putting a swivel here, is to also have a quick change. I like to, on my main rod line, put a dual lock and a bead. The bead goes above the dual lock and allows for me not to reel it into my guides, but the dual lock, I can quick change out my buzz bomb colors. Like let's say we're fishing this guy here, it's not doing any good, but I wanna turn and change over to a zinger. Right, you got a couple different color options on those right in front of us right there. You can totally rig a similar setup like that and you have these all ready to fish. So I like to put together leader setups and keep them in small little um, divider baggies and I have my rigs pre-tied ahead of time all ready to fish and that'll be a difference maker for you whether you break a fish off or you have to get another color tied on and you don't have to be losing out on valuable fishing time. So that is a quick, simple setup rig that I love to fish for buzz bombs, whether off the shore or in my boat, that is deadly.